That's right. I'm here with Taylor Hill, pitcher for the Syracuse Chiefs. Taylor, you're pretty young. You have a great start to the year. What's gone into pitching so well so far? Um, you know, I think it's it's really got to go to, you know, our defense has been playing really well, and our so you know our catcher's been calling great games for me because I'm not one of those guys who's going to strike a lot of uh, a lot of batters out, which is fine. Um, but I think a lot of it has to go with you know just being able to locate things a lot better, locate my pitches and my fastball mainly. Because I struggled with that my first year, um, and then last year I got better at it. And this year, it's kind of you know I've been was able to carry it over a little bit. So, you know, and I can't say enough about how our defense and everybody else has played. Because without them, I wouldn't be doing well. Right. I'll tell you that. <laughs> well, it seems like you, you you're kind of a contact pitcher a little bit. Is that kind of what you learned about yourself for the, yeah. in the first few years as pitcher here? No doubt. And I think. Uh, I mean, it's, uh, everybody, you know, wants to throw 100, and that's not always the case. I don't throw 100. So, um, you know, I, I just want to go out there and throw strikes and try to get – you know, I want to see the least amount of time I can spend on the mound as possible. I want to be able to go out there, get three outs, and go back in and get the offense going. Um, you know, whether I strike three guys out or get three ground balls or three pop flies, it doesn't matter to me as long as I'm able to get outs and get them quick. Yeah, and I guess off the mound a little bit here. What do you what do you like to do? Tell us a little about Taylor, who's not the major league baseball or the minor league baseball player. Oh <laughs> man, uh, I enjoy playing cards. We play a lot of those in the clubhouse. Yesterday we went to a movie. Uh, that was one of our our second off day of the year, so that was great. That was wow. a real treat. Um, I don't know. We're kind of waiting on the weather to warm up, and uh, you know, today it definitely did. I think we're. I mean, I love to golf. I'm not very good. <laughs> But I enjoy it. Um, so hopefully we can get out here soon and, and play a little bit. Um, other than that, right now there's not a whole lot going on in my life. Uh, <laughs> other than this, um, right? This is your life right now. <laughs> yeah, I can't complain though. Um, I'm from Nashville, so I love it there. I know my mom was telling me uh, it's about I think 85 or 90 there. So it's a little hot this time. Yeah, that's hot versus here when it's been chilly like every day almost <laughs> so but today's perfect so hopefully we can keep it around this temperature for a yeah. while it'll do, be good do you get used to that at all in the first couple months of the season the, the chilly temperatures pitching under uh, those conditions considering I, you are from nashville too uh, i'd like to say yes but not necessarily <laughs> we started uh, so well too in the, in the chilly temperature yeah it just depends i mean it's i can't complain i've pitched in the cold before as long as it's not like as long as it's not raining then it's then it's usually not too bad the cold's okay <laughs> Yeah. I, I prefer the snow. I know you guys probably don't, but we don't see snow very often in Nashville, so <laughs> it's uh, it's kind of a treat for us, except for when the city just shuts down because they can't drive in a quarter of an inch of snow, right. or rain for that matter. <laughs> that's that's nothing for us up here. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that's a joke. They just forget to, have, forget to use their blinkers, forget how to use their brakes, and, you know. It's chaos. It makes, it ex it's extremely upsetting. Yeah, right? and uh, I guess as you were coming up as a young kid, you know, who, anyone you idolized uh, in the major leagues at all? Um, well, my dad is from uh, Detroit, and he moved to Nashville when he was young, but uh, so I always grew up watching them, <laughs> and I know he's obviously really good, but I didn't really start watching baseball intently probably till high school. <laughs> Um, but I'd have to say probably Justin Verlander. Just, I mean, I know that's an easy one, but right. that's kind of like that's who I watched because that's yeah. who my dad watched. I didn't really have a choice. Right. Um, <laughs> Which is funny because you don't like th you don't really throw a hundred, but he, he can throw a hundred in the I eighth know. inning if he has to. I agree. <laughs> I agree. I don't know. He's just fun to watch. I yeah. like to watch him pitch because he really knows how to do that. Mm -hmm. He's not one of those guys that just goes up and see how hard he can throw it. Right. He knows what he's doing. Yeah. He's a pitcher, as yeah. they, they call him, not just a thrower. And I guess in the last next couple of years here, what what are your goals? What are you looking to do? And not only in the short short term, but in the long term. I know everyone's goal at this point is to get to the majors, but you know what is your goal at this point for the rest of this season? Um, you know, I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing. That's mm -hmm. I can't really control anything else. You know, obviously the goal is to get up there, but there's nothing. You know, I can only do so much. Mm -hmm. um, and it's not a bad thing. I think uh, you know some people look too far into it. You just got to do it. You've got to control what you can control. And so far, you know, it's that's what I've been trying to do. It's not always, you know, I make it sound a lot easier than it is sometimes. Um, but you know, I, I think just getting up there and you know, hopefully, at some point, and uh, you know, maybe stick around. We'll see. Everybody says the hardest part is sticking around up there. It's not just getting there. Mm -hmm. So. We'll see. You know, I, I love it. I love the game, and I, can, uh, I can't complain about anything that's happened so far. Yeah. You've been doing well so far. Well, thank you very much today. I appreciate it. No problem. Let's go back to the studio.